Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the Outer Haven exclusive pre E3 podcast, which is not exclusive because it's just some guys talking about things we want out of E3. This is episode number 68 of the Outer Haven out of Haven podcast. My name is Clinton Navigator Bowman, residing in Brooklyn, New York. Let's cut through the introduction real quick and get right to business. Uh, yo, Hamlet from San Diego, sunny San Diego, right near Petco Park, home of the Padres. Brandon Wilder, Frank New, what's up? It never rains in Southern California. How? It, oh, indeed. Then we also got the man, the anime post, Mr. JJ, oh, so sexy, Piedra. Josh, what's up, man? What's good, everybody? All right, we got yo Gabriel Z slash Lemain. What's up, Gabe? Hey, what's up, guys? William Shadows Cock. What up, man? Konnichiwa, bitches. Oh, episode sixty nine is gonna be great. We also got uh, we also got <laughs> Carlos the Angry Elf Abdu. Carlos, you Spanish sexy man. What's up? What do you What do you now? Yo, mura, 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 mura. And then we also got the big boss, the man in charge, the HNIC, Mr. Ordinary Guy himself, Keith Hacks Mitchell. What's man, up, if you guys could see me, you can see how much, how hard I'm shaking my head right about now. <laughs> oh no, my God, what no, have I got William, myself into? If William is on episode 69, it's, it's going to be a wrap. But, uh, <laughs> oh, I'm going to be there. Don't is worry. Keith cursed to be the internal straight man to all of our jokes? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that's what we hire him for. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I mean, I mean, I mean, real talk. I mean, he he might be the stream man, but at least he's not part of the Poly Taco conglomerate. Oh god, uh, <laughs> you just won't let that die, will you? Yeah, he just uh, he just hired a whole team of polar opposites of him. <laughs> <laughs> I think everybody is the polar opposite of me. You're also pompous ass at times, but I <laughs> mean sometimes, all the time. <laughs> the hell uh, all right ladies and gentlemen so basically the premise of this podcast is to go through e3 predictions what we're expecting from bethesda pc pc gamer microsoft ubisoft ea nintendo and you know sony with their ever loving we love you but we love to disappoint you the year after presentations oh man that's the best presentations of all time <laughs> final fantasy 14 Oh, Online. speaking of Final Fantasy, I forgot to tell you, Square Enix is having their own And uh, Squeenix, show. that's right, Squeenix is having their own. Uh, <laughs> you know, it's funny because it's normally, you know, it's Aisha Taylor, <laughs> it's Aisha Tyler, Dana White, and a bunch of other people, and Reggie. So it's like, you know. Hey, she did good. She did a good job last year. And the Ubisoft. She, Ubisoft she, yeah. She's the only good thing about the Ubisoft percentage. Keep and she's mind. cute. And she's Listen, cute. That I works. Love, I love, you know, most people know her as the black girl from Friends. I know her from Who's Line Is It Anyway. I, mean, I know her as uh, Lana here. from Archer. Yes, Lana, yes. Right. See, see, let's play Lana. Yeah. So we're going to start on Sunday with the PC Gamer. Pro- Say what? PC Gamers on Monday. That's on Monday. I thought that's Start from Bethesda, man. Bethesda, Monday. Bethesda, Bethesda. So we're going to start with Bethesda. Um, Keith, what are you looking for through out of Bethesda's mouth? On... Out, out of their mouth? I don't know about out of their mouth, <laughs> but uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> I want to hear more information about Fallout Four. Uh, oh yeah, that was a big announcement. That was a big announcement this past week. Oh, yeah, that was a huge. that was a huge announcement. People have been asking for you know Fallout Four for years. The only sad part is you know Bethesda didn't really do a good job with you know their last Fallout title. Mm-hmm. And their game engine is pretty much. Oh, you're talking about New, New Vegas? Yeah. Yes. Uh, so they're going to have to do a lot of convincing to make everybody happy. People are already complaining about how the game looks and the graphics. Yeah, either way, you know. Uh, but yeah, Fallout is the major thing I'm looking for for, for, for that company. Um, I don't really know much else to really expect from them, honestly. Uh, they, they, they've already released El- the Elder Scrolls online. They don't, unless they're going to pull something out of their ass... I don't know what else they have to talk about. Which, by the way, the Elder Scrolls Online Tamri Unlimited, you can catch our review of it by our newest our newest writer, Gary Marston, on www.theouterhaven.net. Check that There's out. There's the hype look, man look, doing look. his job. Check, check that out. So, Carlos, uh, what do you expect out of Bethesda? Ah, uh, well, for one, absolutely nothing. I didn't really knew Bethesda had a show before. Uh, I, you know what? And this is on a general notice. I question 
Their decision oh, to release an information on Fallout 4 before E3. That's that the hype before the show, though, man. I that mean, we all, I also, show, but that would have been mind. a blockbuster announcement at that But show. keep in mind, I also question why Sony was like, yeah, let's do a PlayStation 4 announcement and totally hey. help our controller. Hey, can like, I recant my, can I recant my, uh, my also I'm looking for? Cause I, I, I completely remember why my brain went sideways there for a second. Uh, I forgot who possessed it also has under their, their grip now. Doom? The, yeah, Doom. Doom's oh, going to be showing off. And they did okay. confirm, okay. and they did confirm that. That's what I'm looking Doom for. Doom is going to be there. <laughs> Yep, Doom is going to be there. Uh, any, I mean, if anybody else wants to add anything, because, I mean, we kind of did touch on the two biggest things out of Bethesda on June 14th. At, on June 14th. Adding one play Elder Scrolls? Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm hoping that they announce that Elder Scrolls that doesn't fucking suck. Yeah, that's the thing. I mean, I, mean, I enjoy Skyrim. I'm hyped for Doom, because I'm a huge first-person shooter fan, and uh, I grew up on Doom and Quake, so I would really love to see what they do with it versus what id Software did with it in the past. Keep in mind, keep in mind, I mean, our guy gave it, I want to say he gave it a 8 out of 10? He enjoyed it. He enjoyed it. I don't know. I, I guess it made a lot of changes. I remember playing Elder Scrolls Online when it was in beta and when it first came out on a PC, and it was like, oh, uh, this game has a lot, a lot of issues, and I passed yeah. on it. But well, so, uh... all right, so we got the next one coming up. But the first one, as usually comes up on Monday, is Big Green, Microsoft. Uh, oh, yeah. We know that they've announced a one terabyte Xbox One console with a brand new controller that features a 3.5 millimeter input inside the controller built in. So for those of us that bought the adapter, flip table. Yo, yo, I don't, <laughs> even, I don't even care about that. I'm I'm more uh, look well as far as hardware. I'm looking forward to to the Xbox One adapter for the PC that are they're finally giving to us. <laughs> yes, that's true. They are giving that to us. But also, I mean, I believe that Phil Spencer <laughs> did say that they will be talking more about PC gaming. As yeah, well as not for, not for... Doing, well some doing to Microsoft, but he's going to also show up on the PC gamer event, which is right. on Monday. And you know also, what? He will also be talking about. He'll. I know for a fact they planned on doing. We run that. We ran the story a while back. Uh, that it will be showing off mostly exclusively first party IPs. That is not true. So Auto? more Killer Instinct. No, this was out. This was out of. This was from Phil Spencer's Twitter. I'm right. They changed a couple of things. Come certain titles that they were going to show are not going to be shown anymore. They will be shown during Gamescon. Awesome. Scalebound, Scalebound, and uh, Crackdown yeah, were yeah, supposed to be shown off. They pushed right. them off. Well, then again, I mean, Gamescom is, I mean, we think E3 is bigger, but E3 is a big. No, Gamecom Gamecom is Gamecom huge. is huge. And it's open to the public. Gamescom is huge, and a lot of people really go to Gamescom and pay attention to Gamescom. So. And the event, and the uh, the revenue is, uh, is bigger. <laughs> uh, but it's funny that you mentioned the PC adapters, and you know, going from the sales on Microsoft, I mean, they're doing right good over here over the, by the States, but internationally, Microsoft has always been struggling to prove themselves beyond their bro gamer image. So I always wondered, and maybe this is for another podcast, but realistically, how far does Microsoft have in the whole Xbox franchise before they say, you know what, fuck it, Windows 15 is a console, it's a PC, it's the PC and console in one, we're done. That's uh, Microsoft actually is doing really good globally. It's just in just one traditional territory. They're not doing well. And Japan. You know mm -hmm. why? We know why. We know why. I mean, I mean, outside of xenophobia, they're pretty brand loyal in Japan. Yeah, I mean, they they have a decent market, decent market hold in Europe, in in uh, in Asia, and I right. was in North and America. Also, and then Microsoft is now starting to kind of you know catch up and surpass the PlayStation Four in America. So I thought I thought they're still in catch up. I don't think surpass. No, they're catching, I think they're still yeah. in catch up. They're on pace to surpass. They're doing good because Sony has managed to fuck up so many times. Um, oh, I mean, yeah. Because oh, you remember so the PlayStation. Many. We remember what happened with the PlayStation Three. I mean, they fucked up bad. So, so, but so, so. it wasn't that bad because by, by the time they actually got their foot up, PlayStation Three was kind of a system worth it. But the PS4, their launch titles. We'll save that for the Sony. Launch we'll titles Sony are a thing of the past for for consoles. I'm, I'm sorry, mm -hmm. unless the you're a Nintendo the... system. 
I yeah, the only no, thing that is no lives on launch titles, and, and that's what they that's how, that's what they do their best business. They live on launch titles. Going back to Microsoft and the PC, I just wonder because they are so rooted in PC market, they kind of dominate with all the everyone has PCs right now. I wonder, wouldn't it just be smarter to forget the Xbox? Just no. Give I'll stop you there. And... I'll stop you there. No. Yeah, I was about to stop you. The, too. The, the issue with Microsoft is Microsoft is notorious for telling the PC, okay, the PC gaming side that they are focused on them and they haven't forgot about them and they've been telling the PC gaming side lies for 10 years. Oh, they Microsoft has not focused on the PC market since the introduction of the original Xbox. Oh, because so you know why? Because you know why they felt it, you know, it was like with the Xbox, they already have that. I mean, the Xbox is very close to being a PC, but what so about? That- but what about all those games for Windows things that they that they pushed that they, oh, that they pushed games, for a while? You talking about games for Windows Live, which was a complete and utter mess. Which games for Windows you, Live was, it was shit. Attempt, it was it was an attempt at a push. But no, keep in mind, Street Fighter it was, was a Street bad. Fighter, and then Street Fighter had to really get ported over to Steamworks because you know that game was still kind of popular. Well, that's not that, that's that's finished with the, the the whole Microsoft gaming thing. So Microsoft is popular, obviously, because of their software. But their software division is not the same as their gaming division. At all. Their, no, 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 no. their gaming division is focused on, well, was focused on strictly Xbox with a few things thrown up to the PC market. Gears of War, old as Halo 1 and 2, well, Halo 3 was out, and a bunch of other random games. Don't forget about the Gears Gear series as well. Yeah. Oh, but, no, they're, they're talking about gear, bringing back Gears as well. I mean, they did, they did do a video... No, Gears is coming back, but it's not for the PC. Gears is coming back. Um, Oh, speaking of other comebacks, uh, Microsoft has been uh, stating that because of the popularity of Killer Instinct and because of the hype over the Battletoads thing over at Shovel Knight and because of that uh, new concept Conquer game that they were throwing around, Project Core, Yes. That they're trying to bring back a lot of the rare IPs and using them. Maybe, because, maybe mind, aside from keep, another Killer Instinct, keep we in may mind, see another. Keep in yes. mind, Carl, Carlos. Keep in mind, you want to go back to you want to go back to Conquer because they put Conquer in Project Spark, which yeah, that's is what you were, basically that's the one, create yeah. your own game, like literally create your own game, which Microsoft so, is giving people the power to do that. So we could be seeing another Conquer. Conquer making another appearance at E3. Maybe some talk about Battletoads coming back. It would be nice to finally hear something official about Battletoads. Who owns the IP? Who owns the IP? Microsoft for currently. Microsoft. It's rare. That yep. was like one of the very early rare IPs that they made. Yeah, no, it's, so, it's also, right. and, and, and plus we also too. got Rise of the Tomb Raider. So that's probably which is a that. timed exclusive. So timed exclusive, yeah. correct. Yeah. Yeah, nah, if you're yeah. going to the PC side of things, I mean, with it coming out next month and launching, I would actually expect Microsoft to talk about Windows 10 and the whole Xbox streaming experience as well. Well, I, I, Josh, I expect them to talk about that there and also the, PME, uh, PME, the PC Gamer Show. And would I you... expect myself to fall asleep when that shit happens. I will be up. I will <laughs> be you, wide awake. Which will, I mean, the PC Gamer thing is happening at, what, 8 p.m. on Monday? Uh, the mm-hmm. PC Show is, yes, I'm looking at the list right now. Actually, I'm looking show. at E3, and it's on June 16th, actually. Uh, e th- yeah, uh, but, June 16th uh, is Tuesday. What are you talking about? Yeah, PC Tuesday is Tuesday. Show. Tuesday, yeah. It's on is Tuesday. it Tuesday? It's on yeah. Tuesday. Tuesday at 8 p.m., yeah. 8 p.m., 8 p.m. Either way, I'll be watching it. I mean, it's not like I'm watching Monday Night Raw anyway, because Sony. Um, because Sony. <laughs> but, but, um... Okay, we move on to electronic EA. arts. Um, EA games. My 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 favorite my favorite um company for sports games that's not NBA Live. I know I know that's Candyland for you, man. I mean, real talk. Actually, actually, I, I I don't I want I want I want Carlos to go on this one. Wait, Wait hold on. Who let's, me? Let's run through. Yeah, you. Let's run through. Let's, well, well, I'm gonna let you go, Carlos. Let's run through what's gonna be done. You know what? No, I wanted the Clinton to go back because I know you all, all are into this sport. Well, game, well, hold on. So. Well, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, we're gonna do a little back and forth here. EA, in the press conference on June 12th, uh, today, put out about their, you know, broadcasting their press conference on June 15th at EA.com. They also stated that they'll be in, w- inviting l- hundreds of local high school and university students in the live press conference audience, exposing them to the most exciting week for the video game industry. They're also on the live stream for those of that aren't able to watch. They're giving away 400 PC games for free, starting at 
starting at 4 p.m. Well, and to be fair, they already do that now on Origin, but they give us old ass games from 10 yeah, years ago. But they're giving away 400 free games, so it's like literally 400 people have the opportunity to win free games. At, so um, the, when, when did the Evil Empire became good? No, no, they're, they're, they're not good. They're back. not good. They're 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 neutral at this yeah. point. Yeah, they're trying to buy so, back uh, pretty, favoritism. All right, so pretty neutrality. much the games that are, the games that are going to be talked about obviously will be FIFA 16. Which announced, which recently announced that there will be twelve women's national teams in the game. Yay! Oh, Give it the feminism. Manager mode. Come on. <laughs> we, I mean, me and Gabe talked about this already. Um, Madden NFL 16, which you know the big cover vote was a big thing with Odell Beckham Jr. I am praying for my Giants not to get hit with this curse because that oh, was a real oh. thing. Too late. That You're is a fuck, thing. son. The minion, You're fuck, son. The minion, par- the minion paradise uh, game. That'll that's be not for mobile. That's Mirror, not talk about mobile. Mirrors and no. Catalyst, which is a big thing, which was which was outed this week. Um, that's right, and that's the only yeah. thing I'm gonna be watching after that. Ah. Yeah. Ah. Back to uh, the other song. Yeah. NBA ah. Live. NBA Live 16. Let's hope this game can be better than last year. If you want to check out the NBA 15 review, go to www.theoutofhaven.net. <laughs> or player. Or or look hey, at a real oh, basketball game. The comments. Just ignore the comments. Real basketball <laughs> games, 2K. <laughs> right. They're going to be talking about Need for Speed, NHL 16, um, EA Sports, Rory McIlroy, PGA Tour, which I love golf games. See you, They're Tiger. Ah, oh, golf games are okay. Uh, Star Wars Battlefront and Star yes. Wars The Old Republic, <sighs> Knights of the Fallen Empire expansion. I give uh, it uh, two fucks. G- not given. Don't care about that. Only care about... No. Uh, go ahead. No, what? I gave no fucks given because this is not Star Wars one eighty twenty eight whatever oh, the number was. Yeah, this is not that awesome Star Wars game that's coming out on mobile. This is not. It's 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 Battlefront. We played Battlefront. We played well, Battlefront three times. It's well, just Battlefront and HD. I, I, I'll stop you there. I'm actually, actually looking forward to Battlefront. Battlefront. They're they're significantly reduced stuff from the previous versions. That's what right. I'm referring to. <laughs> I'm looking forward to Battlefront, the need for speed, just to see, hopefully, they don't mess it up and uh, Mirror's Edge Catalyst. That's it. I don't care about the sports game. Sorry. You know what? You know what? I, I will be frank. I will be frank. You know, I, I give EA a lot of shit, you know, objectively. You ha- you're supposed to give EA a lot of shit. That, that's your job as a game journalist. But No, but... really. I mean, the reason, <laughs> I mean, keep in mind, I love, Matt, I love Madden. I love Madden. Madden is a great game, even though it's the only NFL game in existence. But yeah, blame me. Nah, 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 nah. No, it's not. There's another one coming. There's another one coming. Oh, what you got for us, Keith? Keith. Wait, seriously, you have not been paying attention to another football game running in the Unreal Engine four that may be announced during E three by EA. Maybe, maybe. You did did you forget about did you forget about did you forget about Joe Montana's football sixteen? Oh yeah, Joe Montana the Legends football game. That's right. Yep, you forgot about it. But it's still not a it's still not a fully fledged NFL game. Kind of like, you know, NFL It's Joe Montana. But it's It's Joe Joe Montana. Montana. I'm sorry. That that's that's my childhood right there. Joe Montana is pretty dope. I mean, NBA Live, I I shit on NBA Live fifteen because the game was terrible. Like terrible. Yeah, we know all about that. So it's yeah, everybody else. So everybody you know, else. Hoping, and I thank you for that. And I, I hope they fix it. I hope they fix it this year. Because I'm sorry. Keep in mind, Russell Westbrook's on the cover of that shit. And that's the only and, 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 and the only way he can actually win a championship is in a video game anyway. Wow. <laughs> that's the damn shame. Sasa, Sasa. You know, he can get traded to another team. I know he can totally get traded to another team. I mean, don't get me wrong; the playoffs are not on right now, but I mean, it's two-two. Keep that game. I'm sorry. That's not That's talking about that game, but that game was was fantastic. That's yeah, not yeah, talking about yeah, that. Yeah, I game. know, but yeah, real talk. But <laughs> but, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna move on to Ubisoft. Um, yeah, we're Ubisoft. Move, before, hold up, hold up. Before you move on, next, there's All also right. like on, on the EA show. There's also possibly getting more hints regarding to the new Mass Effect game as well. So that's something I'm probably looking that's for. Right. I, I didn't hear anything oh. about them talking about that. That'd be nice. Actually, you know what I'd love to hear? I'm never going to hear though. Something what? to do with the Dead Space universe. Uh, right, rest right. in peace, Dead uh, Space. Yeah, right. that's real. Okay. So we I would kill that. We'll kill that universe. Uh, Dead, Dead Space Three, three. Bros in Space. <laughs> Yo, word. I'm all, like, what? All right, so we're gonna move on to Ubisoft. Aisha Taylor, Aisha Tyler's black back. Why do you keep calling her Taylor? Tyler, Tyler, Tyler. It's Tyler. 
He I said himself. that. I corrected myself. But you still said excited. it. It's the second was, time you said it. I was Lana. excited. I'm Lana. She, okay, she's excited. Lana. Now, let's just cut to the, let's just cut to, 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 to the chase here. I cut said, to the fact. I we only care about three games here. We only three games. Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Boo. Hey, 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 don't don't care about it. Boo. And Rainbow Six Siege. And Rainbow Six Siege, which is coming out this October. Yes. I hope they have another fantastic demo of, you know, the division because that was so realistic how people play together last year. <laughs> <laughs> and... So pretty much so pretty much what the announce what what they're talking about right now in the press conference from all the press the press release from June second. Uh they're talking about the division. If those of you that don't know about the division, it's basically reclaiming New York City from terrorists. Or I mean a deadly pandemic, excuse me. And Rainbow Six Siege is is basically a counter terrorist simulation. <laughs> Yep, yep, and yep, Assassin's yep. Creed Syndicate is like you playing twin brothers in London. Uh, tw- uh, no. twin siblings, siblings, siblings. Brother and sister. So, oh, siblings, so yeah, and they finally got the female assassin, but I'm sorry, too little, too late. I'm sorry, too I'm little, sorry, too late. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. We don't know if it's an actual woman. I mean, with all the craziness going on lately. <laughs> no, uh, really? Did you have uh, really? to bring that in here? <laughs> the politics. Uh, that, that's for another podcast. That's for politics. Another. Anyways, now. Uh, but. Yeah, yeah. And this is the one thing I want to talk about Ubisoft. Like, if if they can finally pull, get their ass, their heads out of their asses, can you please finally unload some details? We're going to be on Good and Evil too. Damn it! That it's game done. is dead. dead. Stop. Yeah, it's been it's dead for a dead. while. Dude, sorry. it's as dead as Bruce Jenner's existence. Uh, <laughs> oh, uh, that's pretty weak. Pretty weak, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I tried. I'm sorry. This, this ain't uh, a night of the Apollo, man. Get out. <laughs> that, what? Game, what? that game is never coming out. Ever. Yeah. It's done. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to be the one with. Oh, God. Yeah. No, but I mean, I love Beyond Good and Evil. I love Beyond Good and Evil. That was a great game. It was a great game. The HD port was amazing. But I'm sorry. Everybody's right. Let's be real. That, no, no. Not coming. I, I, I want to know the Rayman. That's just me. Oh, Rayman. I want Rayman to Rayman still around. That's a possibility. That. The last Rayman did really well. That's a big possibility. You're not going to see that for a while. You're not going to see another Prince of Persia. You're not going to see another Beyond Wait, Good and Evil 2. It can come back. It came back two times in two different, two, two different flavors. And keep in mind, and also keep in mind, you know, Ubisoft does own Tetris. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Enough that of that. that, movie, though. The, 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 that Pixel. Movie. Pixel. Pixel with Adam Sandler. Oh, great. Well, is that yeah, mostly Namco that's... properties, right? Uh, right. All right. <laughs> you know, and then and then the final one for Monday during Monday Night Raw for those of you that watch Men in Stretchy Pants or Professional Wrestling for those that initiated. Uh, that's a big oxymoron, professional wrestling. I, I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But we love it anyway. Yeah, we love it anyway. John Cena, the walking wrestling trope. Um, <laughs> Josh knows this to be true. Dead okay. silence. Dead silence. Oh uh, yeah, so John Cena lost yet? What? I mean, John, he got my, yeah. he got beat by fucking Kevin Owens in the last pay per view. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, yeah, sounds so good. That guy. Anyway, clicks. Sony. All right, all right, Sony. Well, we know what we are not getting from Sony. What's Security? that? Anything new? But I'm kidding. <laughs> wow, <laughs> no, really? No, no, I'm calling it. I'm. Movie. I've been saying this for months, and I'm going to keep saying it. I Grand fully expect Turismo yes. Kevin. I expect to hear something about that title. Uh-huh. Gran Turismo right. Seven. Wait, hey guys, what about what about the one we've been all been waiting for for Sony? Crash Bandicoot. Oh, 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 no. Seriously, don't even mention that game. It, <laughs> just stop. All Stars Battle yeah. Royale Two. No, 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 no. I'm talking, I'm talking about the game we're all hyped for. The Last Guardian, right, guys? Yeah. Uh, yes. yes. Right. Uh, Wait, now hold up, hold up. It was listed on E3. It yo. was listed. Real talk, real talk. Uh, I'd be, it would be nice to see a Vaporware title actually come, you know, to be existent. However, however, <laughs> after everything I've seen this uh, past couple of days uh, from out of the right field, even surpassing my expectations for Uncharted 4 is Ratchet and Clank. Oh, Yo, yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah, that anyways, game looked Street beautiful. Fighter, Street, Fighter 5, Street Fighter 5 is going to be at the PlayStation booth in E3. Can, can we talk about why all of the good titles from Sony is getting leaked, like, before I think E3, honestly, I think I think Carlos, I, th- I think man. I think because the fact that Sony has a has a has a huge list of titles that are going to be at their sh- at the show for them. Yeah, but it's just ninety percent of them, ninety percent of them are fucking indie titles. Let's be real. 
and, and the other the other ninety percent is gonna be from Ubisoft, from EA, another Batman, and oh, we're gonna uh, talk we're about probably how, Grand Turismo. Hold on, hold on. EA will be like exclusive content for Madden on PlayStation, and I'm gonna sit down there and look at them, and be like, "Are you bitches serious? Are we doing this shit all over again? What the fuck?" And that, was that before or after Ubisoft is putting exclusive content for Assassin's Creed Syndicate? You know what's well, stupid? What pissed me off was about the whole NBA 2K thing. Hey, stay, on target. Stay, stay on, on target. Stay no, on target. Stay on target. We're talking about stay Sony. Stay on target. We're talking about Sony. We're talking about Sony. No, because that's some bullshit. I'm sorry. You know, Xbox talks about, you know, not treating their their gamers like second-class citizens. Yet every other company is like, well, fuck it. We're going to do it anyway. Did you, you, did, did you ever, did, have you been in game journalism very long? <laughs> Yes, yes. I mean, Josh can verify. Yes, 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 I have. Okay, so you understand how this works, right? Yeah, pretty much. All right. Uh, mind, uh, mind, mind uh, illuminating this for the audience a bit? And what is that? Well, the, the, the lesson that... Uh... The lesson that needs to be learned. Yes. Yes, uh, I, I think we learned no, quite a while. There's... there's... <sighs> This is video game journalism. You expect one thing and another thing happens. You expect a company to re- You expect a company to react or to abide by certain rules, certain guidelines, Bro, certain philosophies, and they don't. And then you get upset. This is Bro. the way of the world. This is what happens. This, I mean, that's journalism in general. You know, you can. What's 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 the saying? What is it? What is it? What is it? One say. Oh, I'm sorry. There's so two, there's so many of them. I get them confused. Bottom line. Here's my favorite saying. Don't wait for it to happen. Don't even want it to happen. Just watch and see what does happen. There exactly. You go. Yes. Just let it yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yep, yep, yep. Indeed. Anyways, so yes, like we said, like Gabe, much like Gabe, Carlos, and the rest of the matching, Uncharted 4, Ratchet and Clank, The Last Guardian. Street Fighter 5. Uh, Rocket, Le- Rocket League, Street Fighter 5, and Gran Turismo 7. And if it Actually, doesn't... there's a couple other indie games that are showing up there that I, I'm actually interested in. I've been following them for a while. Oh, yeah, salt, on the salt and side, sanctuary. Though. On the peripheral side, what about that VR headset that they're working on? Morpheus. 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 Yeah. yeah. You mean Morpheus? Will 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 it, will it show up? Yes. Will uh, most likely. Yeah. Most yes. Likely. No. They have confirmed Morpheus will be at the show. Yeah, because they're competing awesome. with the Oculus stuff. I with, the final, with the final, we promise this is the real thing. Oculus Rift. Because no, and, and then keep in mind also, keep in mind also like HTC and and Steam and B- Valve are working on their own thing too. Everybody's working on a VR helmet. And then No Man's Sky is going to be confirmed again for E3 2015. So we're going to see a little oh, bit more from No Man's Sky. That's going to be a beautiful. Just, and yes, yeah. and just to go on the, on the niche side of things as well, because like it has been one year since their announcement. Why there has my freaking Yakuza Five? Damn it. Uh, it's Sega. Sega, Sega. It's staying it's stay in Japan. It's Sega. They'll get back to Never. next year. Mm. It's staying in Japan. Come on. No, 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 it's still in the, it's, 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 it's coming. Hey, Will, it's coming. It's coming. It's just delayed. It's still coming. And, and, and also people are like pointing to pointing the bullshit rumors that the, the PS, there's going to be a slim, slimline PS4 coming out. And it's like, what? No. Hey, and you know, and that's the, the possibility. Ter- and plus the whole rumors were going to the one terabyte PS4 as well. There's also that. I mean, keep in mind, you can do a one terabyte PS4 pretty fucking easily. Walk yeah. down to your local micro center, get a one terabyte laptop hard drive, and slap that bitch in there. I'm sorry. Or get there, you save the money. Or, or you know, you know, wherever you get your hardware from. Everybody has a micro center. Oh, or, or, or Best Buy, or or Best Buy, because Best Buy. I mean, the only reason it's a big new big deal for Microsoft is you can't put a hard drive in the Xbox. I mean, you can't put it in the Xbox, right. but you can. But you do can't format it. But you can have an external one terabyte drive, like so many have already been doing for a while. Yeah, right, and, right, even right. The, and even Will for the Wii U has a two, has a what, a two terabyte? <laughs> two terabytes for one game, dude. Hey, I'm I'm just waiting. I'm just preparing myself. Thank you. I mean, Yoshi's Woolly World was announced. Hey. Speaking of Yoshi's Woolly World, Nintendo on June 16th at 12 noon Eastern Standard Time. Actually, you know what? Actually, you know what? I don't think that game is part. That game is not part of their E3 because that game's like it's coming out in two weeks. It's it's already came out. They're gonna talk about the Amiibos, but that's about it. No, but yo, those Amiibos. But but, but, but that was that was a perfect segue, was it not? Those Amiibos for Woolly World are so beautiful. <laughs> Those are the only Amiibos I actually you give a damn what? about. But you, but you know what? Let, let's talk real shit. People so, like, Nintendo's going to talk real shit about the Amiibos really quickly. 
because the guys behind Disney Infinity basically said, oh, Nintendo's being real disrespectful to the user base. But I'm like, I'm sorry, it's capitalism. That's how it works. That's how they get you. Sorry. Oh, but they, but they can, they can always use that whole shortage thing against them. Like, oh, we have plenty of Disney Infinity stuff over here. We're never going to go on shortage, man. Hey guys, you guys, come guys. Down I'm, I'm getting tired of living under this oppression, under this amoebocracy. <laughs> <laughs> keep in mind, keep in mind, there is a problem on the West Coast. There is a strike going on, so it's like, yeah, you know, like what strike? Gotta... Ooh, I thought they oh, settled. Go that. ahead. Did they settle that? Wait, what is the strike? Is it like for the truck drivers? What's going on? For who? Truck drivers shipping. And ship, the shipping, and shipping. I thought they settled that. Well, no, I don't think they did. Well, because yeah, uh, if everyone has have heard regarding the news, like there was a whole regarding to the the port, the shipping crates, the whole shipping companies back. On the on the ocean side of things, with uh, with shipping and all that, there was supposedly a strike union and that. I thought that thing was already settled already, and that that's why a lot of people says like, I mean, it was on shortage because due to the strike. But I thought that was settled because no, now, uh, settled. even if it's settled, there's still the backlogs of the de- developments that have, that still have to be and done. And I've been also been ch- doing some research regarding to the amiibo th- deliveries as well because now they actually have been doing some getting ready for restock of certain amiibos now. No, that's the thing. Certain... Okay, if, if that's the case, yeah, like Gabe said, it's still going to take a long time because you have to log all that shit first. Uh, it's the process. Anyways, start to restock it soon. So, I anyways, mean, but... the man, the manager of Nintendo of Canada, pretty much says Nintendo will announce more third-party support for the Wii U and 3DS at E3 2015. I believe it when I hear it. When I see it, right? Yeah. 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 I think, sure, I think at this will. part, the Wii U is only living on first-party titles alone. Very much. As very many very companies much, have already pulled support from the Wii U as it. Oh, oh yeah, definitely. I mean, but then again, we are getting World Championships 2015. Yeah. Uh, no, nobody cares. No, no, no. Actually, you know, I, 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 it is something to care about because Nintendo is having a, a unique niche over at E3, having their old tournaments all the time. The last last year was Smash. Now we have the Nintendo World Championship. There could be a thing going on that distinguishes the Nintendo show from everyone else. Oh, I'm, yes. not, I'm not. I'm not physical. putting Nintendo down. Um, I actually enjoy some of their titles, and I actually am going to pick up Yoshi just because it's so fucking adorable, That's and right. I want those amiibos. That's but right. uh, Nintendo at this stage, and maybe previously, they're not competing with Sony and Microsoft. They never, of course, and what's funny, they, they never, never were. They, they never were. They never were. They never wanted to. They know, they know they suck. They uh, they know they suck. No, it's not that they know they. It's not that they they know they suck. It's not that they they know they suck. They know their target is different than their than yeah. Microsoft and Sony. Yeah. So they they want, priorities. You know, they understand their prior right. They understand their priorities. Well, speaking of priorities, I mean I'm gonna jo- let you jo- know. Oh, and then I was gonna kick it to Josh real quick about maybe get him one of his sweet one liners about this. Josh. I actually don't have a one liner about this. I just oh. don't fucking care. There we go. There's the one liner. <laughs> There's, There's the one liner. liner. Uh, Thank you, Josh. Uh, of course, I'm just gonna be saying out the, the basic ones. Of course, one we've got. I want the when the heck Xenoblade Chronicles X is finally freaking coming out, and that'll probably be a bit more information regards to, to the new uh, the Star new part Fox of the you? Yeah. yeah. No, I'm telling you now, if Hold Star Fox for you don't show up at E3, we riot. Fuck that. No, it no, ain't no, no, happening. We're, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna get riot. enough Marios. You riot. Gonna... You riot. If Grand Turismo Seven doesn't come for me for Sony, I riot. Why? It's it, that's gonna come. They've they've already announced. They've already stated that Grand Turismo Seven is coming. They yes. just haven't given yes. us an official announcement. So yeah, it's I, coming. We know it's I, coming. So it's there's no reason to riot for that. I we, you know, this hand. Go ahead. Yes. Yeah, I already know that uh, they are developing uh, Star Fox, but come on, that is the one that's coming out before Zelda. So let's guess, talk about guess that what? a little more. Guess what? Don't just get another segment. On another Zelda, don't or care. More Mario. Don't care about Star Fox. You uh, know why? Forgive me for just a little bit of regard to Mario, because like with the whole how Splatoon has been going really well at it, I wouldn't be surprised Yo. if they actually have like Super Mario Sunshine Two or something like that. Don't care about any other freaking first party title from Nintendo. I need three. I need third party shit. I'm sorry. Listen, I sold my Wii U simply because I was like, I, I got sick and tired of all the first party shit. No, if you no. Give I- me- if you give me NBA 2K16, we're oh, using really? the touchpad. We're using the touchpad. Nobody wants that. Oh, Nobody oh, wants oh, that. Time out. We're using the touchpad as the coaching screen. That'd be great. Or Madden. We're using the coat. We're using the touch. The the, the game pad as a as a playbook. Great. 
I would I would eat that shit a lot. Hey, you know, they tried stuff like that with the connects and people were like, no, no. please no. No, no, stop. no, 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 but play calling, but play calling through, play calling through the gamepad. I mean, I'm sorry, that's way more innovative than like being like, yo, audible and uh, yeah, no, well, definitely. it will be a lot. So, you, so you want you, you want your down, you want your downgrading graphics too? Then I guess with that. I mean, keep in mind it's still a downgrading graphics because motherfuckers is still developing for the 360 and PS3. Come Wrong. On, people are stopping that. Have you not noticed that? I know people are stopping that. I mean, yo, some companies haven't. We're still getting like Madden and NBA 2K for fucking. Well, this is EA. Days. Come on now, this is EA. They're like, we like money. Don't you like, like money sorry. too? I'm sorry. If EA I, really I'm like sorry. money, they would open Madden up to the PC. And, and what? And, and that they're see, stupid. The time, I said the they like money. I didn't say they were smart. PC, the last time Madden was on PC was 08, and you know I have a copy of Madden 08. The only thing I'm waiting on on the Wii U is that uh, dag um. Yoshi. Xenoblades. Uh, Xenoblade. Yeah, Xenoblade uh, next. Xenoblade next. Yeah. That's all I wanted for. It. That's, my, That's the only, only thing I, I want. Terrified. But I don't want to buy a system just for one game, though. Come on, everybody's missing keep the obvious mind, game man, that listen, we're not listen. getting here. Well, keep, well, keep, well, keep this in mind. I'm buying a PS4 simply for Grand Turismo Seven, and then yeah. all the other games will follow. So it's like, yeah. Yeah, my brother said the same thing. No, yeah, nobody, and nobody's like magic for no Go ahead, man. yo, Keith. Throw it on us. It's not going to happen, so I'm just wasting my breath. But you know what I want from Nintendo. They're, they've already said they're not doing it. What? Mm. What F is it? F-Zero. Come on now. Yeah. It's kind of like getting another Ridge Trust Racer. Trust me. It's kind of like getting another Ridge Racer. I mean, come on, son. Well, no, we'll power. never we'll, we'll never get another Ridge Racer. And if we don't, if we do get a Ridge Racer and it's not from Namco, I don't fucking care. Yeah, hey, the oh, last oh, one was oh, trash. Oh, the oh, last two last were trash. Was, yeah. I or, didn't play another one wipeout because if, let's just say we get another wipeout and it's like yo, we already getting a wipeout. I don't care. Wipeout is awesome. Wipeout. Wipeout is game. awesome. We're already getting another wipeout, so I don't care. Oh, we are. Yeah. Not in not in name. The people that were part of uh, the company are are working on another game and another well wipeout like game. It's called uh, uh, it's Formula Fusion. Yeah, Formula Formula Fusion. Oh, yeah. right. You told me about that, Keith. But yeah. Uh, but yeah, let's move on because we have one more. We have two more to go. More than two. 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 two, just two. Just two. We, we finished Nintendo. Square Enix and PC Gaming next. Are you talking about two for Monday? We, go ahead. No, this is Tuesday. We've done Monday. Yeah. Tony was the last one for Monday. We're on I'm Tuesday going now. crazy. Keep going. All right, Square Enix, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, nobody uh, cares. They have nothing next. Yeah. Uh, How Kingdom the hell Hearts did they manage to get their own game? Oh, wait. Now I remember because they have Eidos and they have Crystal Dynamics. Well, keep this in mind. Well, just keep this in mind. Uh, Final Fantasy 15 we might hear a little bit about and Kingdom Hearts 3. I mean. Yeah, I know cool. exactly what Final Fantasy 15 is going to say. It's now Final Fantasy 16 and it's going to be a movie and not a game. <laughs> what? <laughs> That'd be awesome. That'd be awesome. Oh, boy, Josh. Josh with the one line. Josh is dropping good. bombs today. Oh man, I mean it's what Josh always does. I mean, real talk, real talk. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. That's if that why we have him on the or, show. Or, or 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 Final Fantasy 16, mobile edition. I mean, seriously, uh, what what does Square have that people want other than Kingdom Hearts right now? Batman, uh, Arkham, 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 Batman. Arkham Knight. No, that's Brave not them. They're that's just publishing them. it. They're, that is that. No, they're they're publishing that. Idols is publishing that. That's them. Right, but they don't control that. that. Only so Warner Brothers control that. that. Yeah, I would Warner love Bros. to see a new version of Einhander. Not happening, but Same I'm here. with you there. Yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong. If, 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 if they surprise us and they say, we patched it up with Nintendo and we're giving you Super Mario RPG 2. And it's like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's not going to happen. <laughs> yeah, our crowd is going to Super Smash Brothers. Not going to happen. Oh, I mean, oh. seriously, uh, Square has forgotten about all their old titles. Einhander, they fought, forgot about the bouncer. They forgot oh, about oh, um, bouncer, bouncer was not that good to me. Toll, yeah, I would I kill agree. for another Toll. Or, or, or another Parasite Eve. Yep. Yeah, they, I definitely. They are yeah. having a Parasite Eve, but it was for the third birthday um, was the oh, third birthday was great. I played that for PSP. That was great. Actually, I take it back. They do have two titles that I want. Actually, well, three. I take it back. Actually, four, four. Uh, if, if you don't mind, I want to run down the titles they could uh, be putting up. Go ahead. Final Fantasy 15, Kingdom yeah. Hearts 3, yeah. Bravely Just Second. Yep, Just definitely that. Oh, yeah, Bravely Second, yes. Definitely Bravely Second. Uh, Return Just of... Uh, Just, 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 Just Cause. Yep. Yeah, that's true. Yep. Uh, another Deus Ex, the new Deus yep. Ex coming Waiting out. Waiting for that. And Rise of the Tomb Raider. Yep. Yeah. Um, and Star Ocean Integrity and Faithfulness. 
Oh yeah, Star Ocean. Yeah. They do Star Ocean. Yes, yes, yes. Because I'm sorry, Star Ocean is that shit. I'm sorry. Yes, no, sorry. yes, it is, man. Yes, it is. Yeah, but I, I completely forgot about that and uh, Bravely Second and Just Cause 3 because Just Cause is a fantastic and, and game. We talk, and we did talk about Do Sex, right? Yeah, and Do Sex, Mankind Divided. Yeah. And, okay, and no wonder they're getting like, their own show. Don't forget, there's another Dragon Quest coming out, though. No, it's that's that's that's, that's, old, news. that's, that's old, like news. old news. That's old news. We already know about game. that. Old news, man. Oh, I get to look at I like the I get to look at Toriyama's artwork in the not Dragon Ball Z set. set, that, set. Yeah, because that, that's coming out. Dragon uh Dragon Ball yeah Dragon Quest X. We already know about that. Yeah, and <laughs> and, and, and then apparently the ending video of, of Final Fantasy Type Zero. You know, you never know Final Fantasy Type One because they're lazy. <sighs> What is that? Fantasy what is that Dragon suck. Quest title coming out for the uh, PlayStation Four? I'm, I'm looking yeah, for it. Yeah, it's supposed to be Dragon like the uh, Dynasty Warriors. The Dragon, Dragon Quest Warriors. Yeah. What is it called? Dynasty uh, Warriors. Dragon, Dragon Warrior. No, Dragon there's a, there's another one. Oh. Oh really? Isn't it Dragon it, Quest Heroes? Yeah, Heroes. Heroes. Oh, Dragon Quest Heroes. Yeah, um, I'm looking forward to that. And that game is supposed to drop. Yeah, that's the that's the one where the uh, in October going through like like uh yeah that's uh, Dynasty Masol. Warriors that's the right? One. That's the is it? Yeah, that's the Masol. Or or Samurai Warriors for those of you that don't un that that don't understand. No, um, no, the real the real one is Dynasty Warriors. Dynasty, Dynasty, Dynasty. Excuse me, Dynasty Warriors, One Piece Fire Warriors. You know all uh, Hyrule Warriors. You know all those type of games. Gundam. Or if you're Japanese, they're called the Musou series. That's Musou what series. I've been saying. I mean, I want to see do, do, do sex but well, but well, how many of us? How many? How, how many of us are Japanese Japanese fanatics besides Josh? Uh, me too. That's how I know the the, the Dynasty Warriors Japanese name: Son Goku Muso. Uh, also, or, or, or like how you play in the game, run away from Lu Bu. Hoping never <laughs> no, 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 you don't run away from Lu Bu because you see in Gundam, the one I reviewed my first for my first assignment here plug plug you don't plug. Run, you, don't, you don't run you don't run away from any lubu i'm sorry i beat that game i'm sorry that game was easy except master gunner i thought all those games were easy yeah peep this i'm on some random website and i was looking at uh square enix release titles over the next months and years and it, it's funny it says final fantasy 7 ps4 Oh no, yeah, it's oh, no, coming. No, no, no. Oh, no, remember that. No, that's the thing that's happening. <laughs> I am not. No, it's listen, not. listen, listen, Brandon. I want you to understand me. Understand me real, real closely. Just get the Steam port, cause it's all it is. Yep. Ah, uh, okay. All right. All right. Crash that. Right. The they're not, they're not, they're not, I was man. gonna say if they redoing that. If you, I was gonna say if you saying they redoing that. And they're gonna put it on PS4. I will buy you a Titan X. No, it's, a, it's not happening. <laughs> no, it's a it's the yeah. Steam port. Yeah. Okay. Gar in other words, garbage. Anyways, <laughs> garbage. All right, ladies and gentlemen, in the final one at 8 p.m. on Tuesday. Told you it was Tuesday. Show, the PC gaming show. Uh, yo, Keith. Yo, let's Keith, Brandon, let's go ahead. Yes. Sorry, let's Man, go ahead. um, honestly, the fact that the show is gonna be three freaking hours, there's just about anything. I, I, I can't even pick out games from this because there's just so many people coming into this but damn let's, show. But let's, but let's really sit down there and talk about the participants according to PC Gaming Show dot com, AMD, Arena Net, Blizzard Entertainment, Bohemia Interactive, CCP Games. Cliff Blazinski. Why are they just saying Cliff Blazinski instead of saying Balski? It's his company, not him. Come because Cliff is a Cliff is bigger Cliff than that. Cliff is a bit. Whatever. It's like trying to say Anyways, Cloud Tales, and it's you, Cloud, you just mean you know, uh, Cloud oh, Imperium. Cloud Imperium Games. Those Assembly, are the people behind Auto. Star Citizen. Yep. Devolver Digital, Frictional Games, Fulbright, Nexon, Paradox Interactive, Pixel Titans, SCS Software, Splash Damage, Damage, Squeenix, Tripwire Interactive, and Microsoft. What? And there's because a couple other people that have not been mentioned that will be there. Uh, and, wait, and, and, word? Come yeah. on. And honestly, this is this is probably the most. Actually, this is the only conference I'm looking forward to, just because due to the fact that they're not going to talk just about games. There's going to be games in hardware. We're going to hear Marcus. Ooh, we're going to hear more about. We're going to hear more about our new Radeon coming out this one too. Would you let me finish? Yeah. God damn it. We're going to hear more about Steam, Steam machines, more about Steam's controller. We're going to hear more about Microsoft and Windows 10 and Windows 10 interactivity with Xbox One. We're going to hear more about virtual reality. We're going to hear more about Valve's VR. We're going to hear more about the Oculus Rift. We're going to hear more about AMD and their upcoming video cards. I mean, it's just going to be crazy and not mentioning 
the games. You know, we're going to hear more about upcoming games. We're going to hear so, more information about Star however, Citizen. So, Go ahead. real quick. However, ACC, my, 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 my most, my, my most important there? thing for me, though, I, I have to say my most important thing is I want to see what things that AMD has to compete with Titans. Titans. Well, okay, so okay, so <laughs> breaking it down. So, so AMD has two different cards coming out. Um, they have the uh, what is it? The R9 390. Ooh, 390? Yep. 390, which is yep. two flavors, the regular and the X, and then they have the uh, Fury and the Fury X, which is coming out later towards end of the year, beginning of next year. Uh, the Fury and the Fury X are meant to compete against the 980 and the Titans. The ones coming out that are talking about E3, unless they swip, unless they switch it up, are going to be the ones competing against the 970 cards in the 980s. And what's funny? Fury X is the 980 Ti and Titan X. And the and the Fury X is going to be limited, rumored to be limited to only thirty thousand units for twenty. We we the, that's all that right now is speculation and rumors. AMD has not said anything. They're they waiting for anything. E3. I mean, I'm just going to throw it out there. It's a rumor. That's what I say. It's rumored. Um, and since we're talking about this, you know, I I wasn't going to talk about this previously, so I'm going to get back on it since we're talking about the PC mod. There's just Oh man, there's just so many freaking games they're gonna be talking about. You know, a drift. Uh, oh yeah. Yep. Has Hellblade. Hellblade again. Yeah. You know, Deus Ex. Yeah, um, Deus Ex. Devil May Cry Four about. is gonna make an appearance there. I'm like, bro, bro. Doom Four is gonna be there. You know, we're a new Fallout. Afro Samurai movie. I mean, a new Afro yeah. Samurai game. Yeah. Seriously? For real? Yeah. yeah, it was just announced. It was just announced. Whoa! Uh, literally four Sam, hours hold on, hold on. ago. Sam, oh Sammy no, Sammy J is coming, be, coming back, right? That that the the um anime was over the top. It was it wasn't bad. I'm not gonna say it was bad. It was it was it was good. But, um, but wait, 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 stop. What are we getting? A new Afro Samurai. Afro Samurai game. Afro oh, Samurai. A game. I talked wait, game. wait, no, okay. no, this is old news. I talked about this. This was at PAX East and it was ass. Really? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, oh yeah, really? Right. Yes. Me and, you, Keith, me and you had a discussion about that. That's right. It was terrible. I sat there for like 30 minutes playing the game and it was terrible. Because they made some major changes to it, it was ass. The, the, the one real game I'm really looking forward to is Star Wars Battlefront. Yes. That is going to be huge. That is going to be a fantastic game. Yeah. Hopefully they don't drop the it ball on that. It could be a huge failure or it could be a huge success. Exactly. There's no in-between with this. No. Man, it's EA. Come on, son. It's EA, but you it's know, Star this is Wars. yeah. This it's is EA is not doing this by themselves. You gotta remember, Lucas Arts is no longer in the picture. This is Disney, and yeah. Disney gives a shit about the quality of the products that are put up under its name. I mean, look yeah. at Disney Infinity. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, shit. Unless their name is Marvel vs. Capcom, and then that's something else. No, 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 no. That was that was that was BD before Disney. Uh, <laughs> really, BD? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll yeah, that's a distinct area. Before I mean, Disney, you see, you see, uh, Keith, uh, just the way that Disney controls all of our copyright law, they now control our calendar. Control keep in mind, calendar. Because keep in mind, like, look at Disney, look at um, look at Disney Infinity. I mean, Disney Infinity three point is coming out. Oh, and I want it so bad. I, you, know like, you know what? You know what? I want the game because the, you know the gameplay, the uh, combat is supposed to be done by Ninja Theory, and even still, you know. I want the figures. I'm sorry. I no, want the you. figures. No, no, no. I want the figures more than I want Amiibos. And I'm not a big fan of Amiibos. No, uh, no, because no. You don't, you're not going to get a Darth Vader Brandon, anytime Brandon. Soon. No, 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 no. You have to go look at the Disney Infinity 3.0 figures that are coming out. And you'll change your mind. They have mm. Star Wars figures coming out. They have okay. figures from Age of Ultron. They're giving us a Hulkbuster figure. And they're also getting, for those of you that are interested in, you know, Pixar movies, because everybody loves Pixar movies. Inside Out is going to be part of this too. Brandon, so did like, you like did you like Tron Legacy? It was all right. Yeah, they're giving us Tron Legacy figures as well. But that's literally. all you're getting because Yo, you're not Tron. getting Tron Three. No, Lou. There is a Tron Three. No, no they, they canceled it. They canceled oh, it. Oh, really? Done. Dead. I'm Dead. sorry. I'm sorry. When did they cancel it? They canceled it two weeks a week ago. Really? Wow. That yeah. sucks. I wasn't paying attention. So I was like, all... Anakin, like literally, like yo, in the Star Wars, like starter pack is like Anakin and Ahsoka. In um the Rise oh, I'm of the Empire playset, Luke and Leia, this Han, Solo, Obi Wan, Vader, Maul, Yoda, Chewbacca, Kanan Jarrus, Ezra Bridger, yeah. Sabine Wren. Where's my mace window? Now. I'm looking at him now. And the and the Hulk Buster, yo, that shit is dope as fuck. I, I can't I can't get into the amoebas. 
I mean, not, it's, my, it's, it's, it's not, not to not play. It's not to use. It's I buy some of these to just sit on my desk and sit around my house because I like how I know, they look. I know. Uh, That's it. Like some of them, if like if there's some, if you actually buy like a second one, then obviously you use them. Obviously, so I mean, for, for some of them, like if you don't care about just being as good think, simple paperweights, then yeah, you can use them. So I might want to yeah, buy. But, but, I might want to buy my uh, my platoon as the, the greatest expert because you. You you are the greatest slave of the amebocracy that we know on the site. <laughs> you gotta go cold turkey, man. You I mean, yo, turkey. Will, do you have a Samus and a Kirby figure? Yes. Damn, I can't sell you mine then. <laughs> <laughs> well, heck, I pretty much have. I'm pretty, I'm pretty much going the otaku's mode here. I'm buying nearly, if not the second copy of each one now. <laughs> I'm so spoiled by uh, from what I saw in Japan. So. Shut up, Brandon. <laughs> Damn it, man! I, 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 so, Brandon, so Brandon, if we, if, hey, if, hey, if, hey. if, if we can get you registered for Tokyo Game Show, can you go? No, you can't go. <laughs> I went, I went twice when I was there. It was pretty good. I have to ask: Do Japanese amiibos work in American things? Yes, yes, yes. yes. It's not. It's yes. not region locked. It's not region locked. Yo, the Tron Legacy one is a fucking door. That's how most people went and got their stuff. Because yeah, because they got yeah, tired I'm of waiting. At it now, looking at it now. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's just painful to look at, man. I, I I love these toys, but god damn, man, you gotta shut down Tron like that. Yo, yo that whole Buster shit. Though? You know, well, first of all, what, you know, since we're done talking E3 stuff, I was like, when they when they first said they're making a Tron movie, another one, I was like, wait, but they said the Tron Legacy didn't do well. Okay. No, I did. So, so I'm not surprised that they canceled it. I mean, you know, they killed the cartoon too. It's this is Disney. I, I, I mean, Disney said, literally, Disney's like this. If it's not making money, if it's not making money, if it's not drawing eyes, we'll get rid of you. For example, ESPN and Rob Parker. But, Ooh. you know, so, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So, like, a or, lot of these or, shows... or if it's not making us money and it's not part of our franchise, then we get rid of you. Like Avengers, like, everybody's heroes, or Spectacular Spider Man. Because keep in mind, because keep in mind, I mean, that's the only reason Stephen A. Smith still has a job. But. <sighs> Really? What? I'm sorry. ESPN is owned by Disney. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, but I would think to say he stands on his own merit regardless. Yeah, he does. I'm, uh, I was fucking around. You know, like maybe maybe, maybe if I said Carrie Champion, I don't know. But, um, oh. you know, but real talk, but real talk, I mean, Disney is doing a damn good job with their games as of late. I don't think they've had one ever bad game recently. But to be fair, you know, the, the, the novelty of Disney I'm... is... I'm sorry, go ahead. The novelty of Disney Infinity is not only the action figures, but the creative mode that you can do with the game. Overall, the game itself is, like, simple as fuck. Yeah, it is. But yeah, unless, you, yeah, unless you get the quest, you know, you get the different quest. Those are fun. Yeah, and the yeah. rest of the games is mostly mobile, so they don't exactly have anything to risk. I haven't actually seen them put their foot forward into video games other than maybe... And Brandon, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to up, I'm gonna, um, one-up you. Give me a second. No, oh, yeah, I, I bet you can't. Guys, you can. is, guys, ladies and gentlemen, this is backstage talk we're doing here on the podcast. Things that me and Josh used to do in Pulsing all the time. I bet you I can. Oh, all right. shit. Well, see. Let's go. Let's go. Did y'all look at, y'all look, hold on. Y'all looked at the link I sent y'all with the Square Enix Star Wars models, right? Yes, yeah. We did. I see it. Oh, I no. see it. That's oh, no, the... what I do. I do that. So go. if you got something that's better than that, okay, Mark that Henry, relax. Up. Oh. Damn, damn, William Dance. <laughs> you said better than that? Okay. Yeah. Better than that. Wait, which one is that? The Sideshow Tone collectible Marvel Hulkbusters? Oh, uh, that's that's pretty damn Yo, close. Sasha, I, I win. I win. No, 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 no. No, that's pretty, <laughs> I said, that's pretty damn close. I win. I mean, but keep in mind. Keep, but, but, but back to Disney, I mean, keep in mind they did. I remember and when this they did guy. release. And I this remember, guy. I remember when they did re-release Castle of Illusion because that was a great fucking game. Yeah, Castle of Illusion was great. Yo, they I re-released those. it. They re-released it on PS3 with an updated version when you, if you have PlayStation Plus. Yeah, I saw it. It's on, it's on, it's on Steam too. Yo, going back to the Star Wars thing, I just found the link. God damn. Yeah, they expensive, <laughs> huh? Yo, yeah, was, this is oh. Optimus Prime is nice, Yo, but it still don't beat the Star Wars. Okay, I don't know okay, about you that. Know you know what? I'm sorry. I said Disney didn't release a bad game. I completely forgot. They've been releasing princess games for a long time, and they've been terrible. They're not well, for you either. Yeah, they're, they're not, not for your market. Yeah. 
He had a cat. Yeah, that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. Keep in mind. Keep in mind. Keep in mind. Keep in mind. Excuse it. Yo, it doesn't excuse it. I'm sorry. It doesn't excuse it. No excuse, man. Keep in mind. You watch wrestling. Come on now. Eh? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Time the fuck out. Oh, oh. Hold on. Let's not go there, nigga. I'm so. I'm just saying. You know. Oh my God. I'm sorry. He went there. He went there. Okay, Jim Ross, relax. Uh, no, there needs to be a video, there needs to be a video game or a movie where your life is narrated by Jim Ross. Oh, Gabriel gave me this idea. It is great. That's <laughs> funny. All right, guys, but well, let's finish up because I gotta go to bed because yeah. I have to get up and work well, in the morning. Awesome. Know, but if I remember correctly, the last Disney game that did that was indeed released that actually was pretty good and people said it was pretty good was Fantasia. Uh, the music one. Oh, no, that was pretty good. It was pretty good. Yeah, yes, yes. What, 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 what about that dropping game that was like... Split Second realistic... was fantastic. And they, it is, was... they closed the studio down. They're retards. I still play that game. I still play it, and it's fantastic. Yo, I it love is, that game, it, it was basically Ridge Racer that we never got on the PC with explosions and shortcuts and the ability to change maps while racing yeah. to take out your opponents. They, yep. they had a gold mine there, and they, they're stupid. Yo, they, 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 they just fucked up right there. Completely so, fucked that up. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, I mean, I mean, any, any, I mean, right now we know for those of you, for those of us that have money and have Steam, I mean, there's a, there's a thing going Actually, on right now. Actually, no, because half the shit is, you know, half the stuff is, you know, people already have or they can't buy it because, you know, yesterday it was all busted. People couldn't buy shit. Yo, Steam was bodied. Hell, some people still can't even play that game right now. Monster Cell, uh, Summer uh, Cell. Really? I still can't play it. There was a problem trying to join a game. Please try again. It's been like this for the last two days. No, literally, literally, crash. Like literally, Steam crashed once that was announced. It was like, <laughs> it just imploded on itself. Like legit. <clears throat> I mean, I picked up. I mean, I picked up. I picked up uh, King of Fighters 2002 for like 2.99. So I was like, they got a King of the Fighters package available. It's like really cheap right now. Oh, the King of Fighters franchise? Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah, it's, it's a bunch of actually man. you know what brandon if you're looking for a game to try out those those that titan uh pick up the uh the metro last light redux yeah that's or, what, uh, if, that's what... if, or if you want to save a little bit of money you save a little, a little bit of money yo pick up the witcher 2 that shit's like 2.99 that's not going to tax his titan though he wants no. he wants he wants to see the power of the titans that oh. game is phenomenal power oh. of the titan what i really want to do is play the batman that's what i really want to do you gotta wait yeah. Wait, you should have yeah, got a free right. code for that, right? No, I, I was just about to get in tell you about that too. I'm like, oh yeah, so I get since I bought two Titans, I get two two codes, so I could give one to you know away, but it only qualifies for the nine eighty nine seventy nine six. No, they're sending that to the Titans. Nope, I'm looking at I looked at the deal on their website, and it what? only qualifies nine eighty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When did they when did they change it? That it's always I think it's always been the nine eighties. Yo, oh wait, no, that's right. They gave, they gave you the Witcher. They were giving you the Witcher. No, it's yeah. the Batman or the Witcher. No, no, for the Titan, they changed it. Like back in May, unless they unless they canceled it, there's a link. Actually, I actually have it. Yeah, you actually, need to send me actually, that. actually, yeah, because I did a story on it. Damn it, back here. Look. <laughs> well, I'm going to the site and looking it up now. But real talk, I mean, if anybody wants to give me Crypt of the Necro Dancer, that's just like seven fifty right now. <laughs> what is Crypt of the Necro Dancer? What the heck is that? Hey, guess what I got? What's up? A review code for Crypt of the uh, Necro Dancer. Oh, <laughs> oh. Yo, Keith. You I want was... it? You review it. That's how it works. No, I mean, you know I'm going to review it. Work for it. You know I'll, wait, I'll, review. I'll sit on it because you got a lot of shit to do. You tell well, me when I, you're done I, and I'll give it to you. I mean, real talk, I still have this beautiful fucking Steel Series keyboard. Yeah, how about you review reviews. those? <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm using it right now so I can review it. Yo, before we go into final thoughts, uh, do you know any of the Kickstarter games that are going to be showing up at E3? Oh, other what than... thing? Um, there are, game? Actually, you know what? Somebody reached out to me about that. Uh, let me try and find my email real quick. Yeah, let, yeah, let me check too, so I, I, I can double check as well. Like, Keith and I get all these fucking emails. It's crazy. There is a company called the uh, Indie Crash E3. Which helped send six uh, people that have uh, indie titles that were kickstarted yeah. um, over to E3. They pay for the tickets and whatnot. I'm trying to find them. What? I just redeemed it. It's downloading now. Oh, see, you got The Witcher 3. Yeah. 
Congrats. Congrats. Enjoy that now game. Now you're like everybody else. You're like me and Keith Enjoy uh, on GOG. Well, Keith is on Steam because he's special. No, I'm on GOG, fool. I'm on Steam. Yo, because you're special. No, I think the version you got was GOG. I don't know. No, I don't no, know which no, one but no for, for NVIDIA, it's GOG. Yeah, so yeah. Yeah. So pretty much enjoy it. Enjoy it. And we will play. Oh, no, there's no multiplayer. Fuck. Why didn't they make Gwent multiplayer? Ah! I wonder if it's going to. I wonder what it's going to say when I have the second card installed. We will have to put it in a different machine. Because you won't get you won't, you won't get the option in. Well, I can no, always. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah. I can roll, roll back to my restore. Didn't they say? Didn't they done. also, Keith? Didn't they also say Soma is going to be an E three? Yeah, Soma's going to be E three. Oh, that game is a wonderful game, son. Well, it looks to have the potential to be a wonderful. Actually, my bad. Through the Woods is a wonderful game. I've seen yeah, people play it. That yeah, that got funded. Thank God it made it. Yeah, I enjoyed it. Like that game was great. I Through really enjoyed it. It was suspenseful. Yeah, it's pretty good. Through the Woods is pretty much a survival horror thing where it based off of, I think it was a Swedish fairy tale. Uh, no, it's, yeah, it's based horror. off of Norse uh, folk tale. Norse fairy tale, yeah. So it, it's actually pretty fucking dope. I can't, I don't know. Through the Woods. Uh, it's actually pretty horror. good. It's basically about um, it, it's the good. tale it, of a mother trying to find her son. Her son was apparently kidnapped by... An entity goes by the name of Old Eric. Basically, Old Eric is like the equivalent of the boogeyman to us, where parents tell stories to their children that, you know, if you're being bad or whatnot, the boogeyman's going to come get you. Well, uh -huh. essentially, she saw Old Eric take her son, and now she's basically telling, I think it's a police officer or whatever, um, the events that happened as far as, you know, her getting her son back. And basically, you're, you're actually living the story. So if you die, you know, the guy's like, uh, do you want to retell that portion again? And she's like, yeah, I want to do it again. But um, I played the first 15, 15 minutes of it, and it was pretty eerie. You know, they, the audio was spot on. The ambience is really spot on. Let's, it really, let's real talk. It made Keith jump. Yeah, I, I was like, holy jump. shit, what the hell? You know, I had this guy running behind you, like, I can't see it, but I can definitely fear him coming. And, you know, the way my setup is in my office, you know, the subwoofer, I, it was like, poof, 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 poof. It was like, uh... I hear that motherfucker. Let me run towards this cave. No, it was actually it was pretty good. I, I I'm glad that they uh, they got, they reached their funding for the game. Indeed. So we'll see more about that later on. And ladies and uh. gentlemen, keep this in mind. Uh, for those of you who are big RPG fans, uh, I forgot that they sent this to me last Thursday. Atlas uh, Legend Legend of Legacy is also going to be at E3. So yeah. Awesome. Um, okay. Probably cool, along cool, with cool. Uh, Etrian Odyssey 2, Lost Chronicle, and. Let's hope Persona 5. It better than will be. I hope. I really do hope so. <laughs> oh, and plus also, we're going to the whole uh, the Shin Megami Tensei X uh, Fire Emblem crossover as well, that project. That you... I, I don't think I'm gonna, we're going to hear for anything for that. We're going to wait for... I, I, would, I would bet more money on hearing Project Crossover 2 than that. Yeah. Uh, it, it, well, maybe from the Namco boot, because I know Sega doesn't have them. Broke-ass bastard. Oh, we're not going to talk about Yakuza 5, but first let's talk about the new Sonic Boom game that's coming out. Really? That's not, no, 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 that's, that's, no, right yeah, that's not, yeah, yeah, yeah let's not, right, and that's so not, yeah, and that's not thoughts. talk about Sonic right, games so here ever again. So ladies and gentlemen, final thoughts on E3, E3. I wouldn't say final thoughts, I would say what, what is the one title you're looking forward to, one thing from Keith, E3. Me and you, ah. me and you, can, me and you both know exactly what we're looking forward to. From E3, from Sony at least. Gran Turismo 7. I'm not yeah. looking towards that. What? No. You said, I said one. One single thing. I know you, okay, so what are you looking forward to? One single thing that I'm looking forward to? Deus Ex. That's what I was going to say. You took Deus mine. Ex. You <laughs> took my idea. And if, yeah. and if I took his idea, then I would say... Uh, no, no, you're right. Ma Mass I, Effect. I, I agree with that. I would like to see Mass Effect. Something from Mass Effect. I, I'm honestly looking forward to seeing more about Xbox on Windows 10. No. I, 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 well, well, fuck you too. <laughs> we worry. I mean, I, I mean that's yours. We, we we've seen enough. We we know that like, it's wanna... past the conceptual stage and it actually works. Yeah, they I won't mean, shut you... up about it. They just won't stop talking about Bro, it. You actually have Windows Ten. Everybody can have Windows Ten. 
No, even the Pirates. Even the Pirates can have Windows 10. I'm talking about you have it. You had it, so you have first-hand experience with it. And, it, and I said it was a great. It's a great OS. I enjoy it. Hey, didn't you open up a VM for everybody to try it out? I did. Nobody tried yeah. it, so I killed it. No, I, yeah. I, I, I no. Remember, Keith, I tried to get in on that shit. I couldn't. I said goodbye. Hmm. So I would say open up another. I would say open up another VM with the current build and see see how everybody feels. Um, everybody else. Wilson. Uh, Ah, uh, man, I mean, if anything, one game that I have to definitely look forward to, I mean... I, I, I know, I know uh, Will probably just no-sold the fact that he was called Wilson. <laughs> we Wilson that. Fist? I mean, okay, Wilson we Fist? got the game of the X last year, so if anything else, I mean, yeah, I mean, again, you know me, Persona 5, like, that's the only thing that I really like, I'm looking forward to. Hopefully they have some details, that's what they hey, want. Ain't that shit coming out in November? Yeah, more yeah. details we're going to this. It's supposed to be sometime this year. So I mean, mostly it's probably I'm looking at the late, late, late end of this oh. year. But yeah, hopefully we can finally have some more information besides from that great review trailer we got. All right. So Gabe, what you looking forward to from E3, bro? Mostly Oculus related, Oculus related stuff for me. And so, Carlos, I'm really curious about. Yo, uh, Star Fox. If they don't have that shit, then they better have a great Kid Icarus too. Or some new IP <laughs> from Nintendo. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, but can't give it no win. win. Give it ten years. You know what? No, I won't. Wait, I won't true. say that. I really won't say that. I won't say that just because they gave us Splatoon. So exactly. nobody that's saw that coming. That's my IP. We can't. We can't keep making that joke forever. Yeah, 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 yeah. that's true. Yeah. No, let, oh, let's play real talk. You know what I'm looking forward to? What I'm really looking forward to from E3? More Mega Man news. <laughs> Uh, uh, jokes. Why? Uh, why? Why are they rehashing Wait, what about wait, what about Konami game? news, guys? Come on, they got something going on, right? Yeah, yeah. They, they, they got, they got, they got, they got a uh, bloodstain. Oh wait, they don't have that. Damn no, it, Konami. Right. Yo, yo, Microsoft with that new um banjo. Oh, wait, that's ukulele. Oh, oh, no, 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 with that new Mega Man. Oh, wait, that's just a TV show. Wait, real talk. Is there anything specifically for any of the Kickstarter crowd at E3? That's You're looking said, for man. specifics? No. Like, I they mean, don't have I think Blow might of their be own, there. Like a ghetto, a ghetto, like the ghetto no. conference? No, no. Fuck. Oh, 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 you're talking about E-Trigger. Okay, you know, E-Trigger. What's E-Trigger? No, come on, yo, ghetto E3 conference. The... Oh, it is? I'm messing with you. Relax. Wow. It'd be nice, <laughs> though. It'd shit. be nice, though. It'd be nice, yeah. I mean, that's practically the yo, only thing we want to see. Yo, real in video games. Let's do this. Yo, he did part. it. He said it. He said it. He said it. <laughs> that's da, one. Da, 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 now I gotta go da, 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 edit it out. Damn it. It's just one, and it's at the end. Let me have that one. No, but I gotta go one. edit it. No. Exactly. We gotta. We got. We have to be able to show our podcast before the NAACP. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo. <laughs> Elf, right. how are you going to share a picture and you not going to give us access to it? All right, real, uh, talk though, real, talk, real talk, though, I mean, we're, we're, I'm also going to be on the Trey and Adam show at TreyandAdamShow.com this Thursday. Nobody knows who that is. But I'm explaining something, genius. Thank you I'm for acknowledging talking, that. I'm going to be talking E3 with the boys over... My boy Adam Martin and my boy Trey Stone, we're going to be talking about E3 and all that stuff. Then, I'm old, then if God wills, uh, we will be back on Saturday after E3 to really break everything down. Sure. Now, hold up. E3 doesn't uh, end until Tuesday, though. No, it, it, the, the conference is over on Tuesday, but the event itself doesn't close until Thursday. Yes, yes, Thursday. It's closed on Thursday. Day. That's what I'm saying. I'll be also, we about... have our man, on, our, our person on the floor. Yeah, you completely yeah. forgot about her. Oh, yeah. Oh, our new, our new, our other new, um, tiny, <laughs> tiny roster pickup. You know, our free agent that we picked up. Jamie Ray will be at E3. Uh, we'll be at E3. She will be giving us a couple of interviews with some of the smaller indie. <laughs> Indie guys, as well as some other stuff. So, will she be? Will she be doing uh, any video content? No, she will not. It will be completely. It will be completely <laughs> sex based. Okay. I wanted so pictures. Keep a lookout for. Keep Us. a lookout for her articles. Now, 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 if Brand, now, now, we we will talk about this after the podcast. So, take, like Gabe said, take a look out for the pod, for the articles. 
But um, that's uh, that, I guess that's it for us. We'll be back with episode sixty nine. The E3 blow off. Episode E3, 70. Episode 69, the E3 blow off. Yeah. yeah. The blow off. The blow off. Yeah, the blow off. Yeah. Something's yeah. gonna something's gonna mysteriously happen to that podcast. I have no idea. Keith, 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 Keith stop being a snob. Just stop, saying, stop snob. just saying. Yo, so why you gotta be that guy? Episode See my hair? See my hair turn yellow? The, just saying. Oh wait, no, it's blue. It's blue now. Yes. Stay tuned. Keith, 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 Keith. Why why do you like to be that guy? Why why you gotta be that guy? Because I don't want to be that girl. That was that guy first. Yo, can we be quiet? Hey! Oh, 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 God. Oh, that was that's, that's, that's <laughs> Yo, low blows. Low blows. Not from that guy. If you're looking for this episode 69 Out of Haven podcast, stay tuned. I'll be right with you. Lady. God damn. <laughs> Come in the building, son. <laughs> oh, that was great.